Full Moon Blessings. It is time to see clearly the potential of our world. Please join me as we explore the spirit allies and healing medicine of Lily of the Valley and Swan as we create under the full moon through ritual. My name is Kayla Alyssa and I am the Wayward Witch. Before starting, as we will be discussing a botanical that is part of the poison path, I must state the following warning and disclaimer. Lily of the Valley contains glycosides that act somewhat like digitalis found in another poison path plant, foxglove. As a result, it can produce irregular heartbeat and upset stomach. It is considered toxic and should never be consumed. Further, the leaves can also cause skin irritation, so should you harvest the flowers to bring their beautiful scent into your home, it is advised that you wear gloves. Under no circumstances should you consider any of my videos containing herbal information, advice for medical or spiritual treatment. Herbs are powerful and have contraindicators that can respond with other herbs and allopathic prescription and everyday medications. That said, it's time to begin our journey. The full moon for me is a time of balance between light and dark. It is because of the sun's light that the beauty of the moon is revealed to us. In my practice, this energy reminds me to see beyond what is readily visible, to look for the truths that are hidden, and to see clarity into the darkness. With all that is happening in the world, spirits from all the kingdoms and realms are there to guide us if we are open to it, to help us manifest tools to cope with what we are facing in our lives. Tonight's working came to me because I was open to the connections around me. Synchronicity, or serendipity, if you will. When you sit at any water's edge, you will feel a warmth spread over you as the life it sustains greets you. You may see ducks diving with their little butts in the air as they search for food, or as I so often do, regal Canadian geese moving as smooth and powerfully through the water as they do the skies above. But inevitably, your eyes will always be drawn to the pure elegance of the swans. Although mainly associated with truth and loyalty and love, they have other lessons to share. They are a beacon. They draw attention to themselves simply by being, and they maintain a sense of decorum, grace, and it truly seems a feel of ethics in their demeanor. I think to our leaders today and how very much we need them to embrace this energy, to hold a sense of love and loyalty for their people, all their people. Swans also have the gift of foresight, but more so they help you look into the future and accept the healing and transformation that is so needed in the here and now so that we can see the future manifest. It can also be very easy to get caught up in group mentality during gatherings. Swan helps you to maintain your own individuality and to not have your own vision clouded by those around you. Swan will help you keep your vision clear and your true goals in sight. As I walked home, their energies remained very present on my mind. And as I turned the corner into the little walkway to our front door, I was greeted by the little white fragrant bells, the lily of the valleys, or I prefer to call them May bells that line our walkway, and they finally bloomed. Their message was also clear. Lily of the Valley helps us envision a better world. It's as simple as that. Yes, there are many lessons she offers, but not for this working. The working for this full moon began to unfold. Working with Swan and the Lily of the Valley, I plan to create an intentional cleansing spray to use on my glasses, phone, mirrors, anywhere that I need to ensure I am seeing the truth. In a medical grade alcohol base, it will have the added energy to both detoxify, purify, and cleanse. How I view things by removing my own negative thought patterns and to therefore purify my vision, allowing me to see with clarity. Whether it be the truth and beauty that I so often deny within myself, the truth behind the posts and social media, or the truth I see through the lens of my glasses, unclouded by my own personal bias and views. This is the power of the small, delicate, and fragrant flower. Her scent will keep your mind focused and clear, 
The aroma instills peace and strengthens the conscious mind. Her energy will keep your pure sight, third eye, intuition, and ability to visualize the present and future clearly, while heightening your ability to recall all information and strengthening your powers of memory so that all mistakes and habits are not repeated. This energy is needed for those in the place of power right now. Combined with the loving energy of Swan, both allies help you see a better future. Because I am working with a poison path plant in the spell crafting, I encourage you to research other non-toxic plants that hold the same spirit of intention for your creations. In this video, it's do as I say, not as I do, for your own safety and my peace of mind. I hope the intention behind my workings inspire you and I look forward to hearing what botanicals and animal spirits you choose to work with to create your own cleansing spray for clarity of vision. As always, I encourage you to embrace the dark, to find your light, and live in balance. I remain your Shakti Shaman, Kayla Alyssa, The Wayward Witch.